frustration. Um, disappointed in, in a sense of like the courts allowing them to play this out and drag it along. I feel like there's enough evidence, there's enough uh, things in place that we should be able to proceed. Um, it was also frustrating to hear that they're contemplating this plea deal, that they're, um, they may be taking the plea deal that the 4th District has offered them. And I don't think not one of us family members are happy with the plea deal. For them to be sentenced 20 years, but that means they can maybe even spend a year of those 20 years in prison. To know that they're gonna have a life after this, it's heartbreaking because I'm forever scarred by this. It's going to affect me every time I have a traumatic event. It's going to affect me every time I have to put another family member to rest, especially when I have to put my mother to rest, knowing what happened to her mother. It's never gonna go away, you know? Uh, all of us family members on this roller coaster ride of, you know, trying to get through the day without crying, trying to, um, go on with our lives but I have moments where I just stop and cry and I can't control it because it just hurts me I feel the hurt and pain of the disrespect that they did to my grandmother's body